On the subject of sizing, there are some CSS units that you may not have heard of, but which are now really widely supported. How about if you want an image to responsibly cover the whole height of the viewport? Now, you can always do that by setting the height of the image to 100%, but that only works if the height of the HTML and the body elements are also set to 100%. A simpler way is to use the VH unit, which stands for viewport height. One VH unit corresponds to 1% of the viewport height, and so 100 VH means 100% height. You can do the same with VW for viewport width. Here you can see we've set the width of the image to be 100 VW, 100% of the viewport width. And you can see that it resizes responsibly. Another common responsive use case is when you want an image to resize to fit the smaller of the height or the width of the viewport. The Vmin unit, viewport minimum, corresponds to 1% of the viewport width or height, whichever is smaller. If you set both the width and the height to 100 Vmin, you'll get the effect you're after. How about if you want an image to cover the whole viewport but without stretching or squashing? For this, you can use the Vmax unit, which corresponds to 1% of the viewport width or height, whichever is greater. So, if you set both the height and the width to 100 Vmax, the image responsively resizes to cover the viewport.